Good afternoon. This is Dorothy Simon sitting in for Jim Lakey. And today is Friday, April the 12th. This is Cable Channel 3. And you can also get us on the web at sandylandcenter.org. Today's weather. Right now in the square, it is a sunny, and I mean sunny, bright 48, with a high today of 61. Tomorrow, Saturday, we could have some morning showers uh, with a low of 51 going to a high of 65. And Sunday, it will be partly cloudy with southwest winds of 20 miles per hour a low of 44 going to a high of 70 degrees and on Monday it should be partly cloudy with a low of 42 and a high of 63 and on Tuesday promises to be very cloudy with a low of 38 and a high of 52 excuse me but right now the square it is sunny and bright and it does feel good we have some birthdays. Tomorrow, we want to wish April Kenoki a happy birthday, and Sarah Sizemore and Brenda McCandless, happy birthday to you. And on Sunday, George Castning also has a birthday, so happy birthday. And oh, everybody enjoys the birthday for the weekend. I've been talking about this play for a long time now, Pie and Pizza, and it is today. Today at 5.30 we have pizza at Poppy's, Poppy's Pizza, then the bus leaves for Stratford at 6.45, and the movie, The Life of Pie, um, talks about a 16-year-old boy who experiences shipwreck and in, on, uh, on his experiences uh, new life in America and he gets tangled up with some animals so coming out and enjoy pie and pizza with the seniors today and the cost is for $20 for the movie Bus and the Snack. Mark your calendars for April the 13th and the 14th for the senior play and the senior play promises to be quite a suspense as a young couple a newly married couple spend their honeymoon in Stone Mansion. It's an isolated country estate which has been led to them by the groom's aunt. Chauncey has a confession to make and he say he owns up that ever since his childhood he's afraid of the dark and has never been able to overcome this childhood phobia. No sooner has he unburdened himself when the lights go out and they are plunged into darkness. When the lights go back on, the couple is astounded to find themselves surrounded by fantastic characters in, suppo in a supposedly deserted house. And they are all plunged willy-nilly in the midst of a spy plot. But a spy plot with a difference. What the difference is? you'll have to come out to discover it. And the cast promises you that in predicting that difference, you'll spend the most hilarious two hours trying to discover what the difference is. So it sounds very exciting. Come and support the junior and senior play on April the 13th at 7.30 and on Sunday at 2 p.m. at the St. John Auditorium. Also mark your calendars for the week of the young child, April the 14th through the 20th. Early childhood education is vital to our community and children, as everyone knows, need a strong early learning foundation to, to be successful in school and in life. And this is what it's all about on the week of the young child. And the, the Ida Long Memorial um, Library has a special um, yearning for learning session on April the 15th at 6.30. All families with preschool children are invited to this family affair. So do mark your calendars the week of the young child, April 14th to the 20th. 
And there's also uh, an event on April the 20th. This event is made possible by the Kansas Highway Patrol, the St. John Fire Department, and the Stafford County Fire EMS, and the Stafford County Health Department. And it's a free child car seat check. And it's done by certified safety technicians. It goes from 9 o'clock until 12.30. And there are also free car seats will be available to be given to anyone who needs one. Uh, and this is not a police check, so you don't have to worry about showing your license or anything. But do come out and have the car seats checked. Um, because some car seats have an expiration date. And um, there are currently some recalls, I'm told, for some of the car seats. Too. So do mark your calendars for that. And the Friends of the Library, um, the Ida Long Library, Ida Long Goodman Memorial Library, have their annual book sale. It's a three-day event. Uh, the preview sale is on Thursday, April the 25th, from 3 until 6.30. And uh, the admission is free for if you're a member of the Friends of the Library and just a dollar for others. And on Friday and Saturday, um, from 8 until 5 on Friday, and from 9 until 11 on Saturday, there's a, there's a sale. And Saturday, there's a, the last hour is a, is a bag sale. Stuff all the books, as many books as you can in the bag. Uh, so do come out and support the library in that effort. We have some menus for you today. Um, at the Sunflower Center. Uh, on the menu today, it's turkey, scalloped potatoes, cheesy corn, sliced tomato salad, flavored mousse, and bread and milk. And then for next week, Monday, it should be lasagna, buttered lima beans, a tossed salad, ice cream. And Tuesday, it's creamy beef chowder, mashed potatoes, green beans, strawberry, orange salad, poppy seed bread, uh, seems like a lot, and beef stroganoff on Wednesday, seasoned noodles, buttered mixed vegetables, crunchy vegetable salad, sherbet, and all good tasting. So come and support the, the Sunflower Senior Center. And in Maxville, today is um, Spaghetti with meat sauce, green beans, a tossed salad, and French bread. Very good. And on Monday, Swiss steak, baked potatoes, carrots, and a strawberry cake. And Tuesday, roast beef with gravy, parsley, tomatoes, tea, cabbage, muffin. All very appetizing and healthy. In Stafford, um, now open is the Taste and See Coffee House. And the Taste and See Coffee House is a non-profit business owned by Lovely Branch Ministries. Uh, it's a non-denominational Christian ministry where all proceeds from the coffee house will go towards a local, state, and world missions. So do come and support the Taste and See Coffee House. And from Monday and Tuesday, it's from 7 to 11, and uh, from 3 p.m. to 6 p.m., and Friday and Saturday, 7 to 11, and from 3 p.m. to 9 p.m. And they have specialty coffee drinks, 100% fruit smoothies. Uh, this is a place where you can spend some time together while enjoying the coffee and meeting friends. So do support the Taste and See Coffee House. And our thought for today Life isn't itself, can't give you joy unless you really will it. Life just gives you time and space. It's up to you to fill it. I like that. Life itself can't give you joy unless you really will it. Life just gives you time and space. It's up to us to fill it.